Hello YouTube, this is a video showing me having a Jimmy light show with timer without the link port working with the Jimmy light show with the six extra outlets. So I did receive it a little bit earlier, but that's okay because I was able to hook it up and get it working. So on the bottom, you can see here, there is no link port. This is the cable. This cable right here running out of it. This is 35 feet long, and that runs into the six extra outlets. As you can see, I did leave the link port because it's a little bit bigger than I expected it to be, but at the same time, you can expect it to be the size of that. You can see it's not being used. It's just gonna sit here, that cable's unplugged. That port does absolutely nothing. It's gonna be used as a auxiliary eventually, where I can daisy chain one controller after another after another if I find any more of these boxes. But as you can see down here, I have the extra, the extra one just hooked um, ran down there. I put a little silicone around both ends of the boxes. So, and then this controller just can just sit on the ground just find it. It does stick up a little bit, but that's okay. This one I have it on a couple bricks because of the speaker cable. So we're gonna turn on the extra unit right now. You can see I had to punch in holes so I can get access. I could have tried to peel up the sticker, but I wasn't exactly that perfect to do it, but you could definitely try doing that. So we're gonna turn that unit on. Oh, I gotta plug it in. I gotta plug in the extension cord I have here, plugging in the units. Turn on this unit. And then turn that to linked. And then turn this unit on. And then we're going to go over to turn that back on. And then we're going to go over to the song loop. As you can see, that it is controlling it just fine. And now we're going to go over to the song loop. thing about this is that while this one is say playing the songs or whatever you want and you flip this one to all on this one will just stay on and that one will be playing music so that's a really cool feature about this and then when you put back the link it links back up let's go over to another song This is absolutely really, really cool. I did not think I was gonna be able to do it with this box alone. Like I thought I was gonna to have to purchase a separate box just to hook up and use this box here. Like I thought I was gonna have to buy another one with the link port, but the board in this is the exact same as the one with the link port. So I was able to hook up this one just fine and it works perfectly. And because of this modification, you could do this with your 12 outlet version too. I could daisy chain for more control boxes and hook up more of these if I wanted to. And the nightlight works on it just fine. This one does not work too well. It works occasionally.
to remember what I was talking about with this is that this, each one of these outlets, if you have LEDs, each one will hold up to 20 lights, 20 100 light strings. So 100 bulbs per string, that will take 20 light strings. With the extra box, now each channel has 40 light strings. And do 40 times six, that gives you 240 light strings. That you can hook up to this entire light show. And then times that by a hundred, you can hook up a lot of lights. Because I'm using a hundred, a hundred uh, count bulbs. So that's going based on a hundred count bulbs. You'll have to calculate it based on how many bulbs you're doing. And here's the effects. And then I could do the same thing. Take this one, I could put it to all on and just have this one doing the, the dancing. And this one could just be my all on. Say if I wanted to draw more attention to my orchestra lights. Or I could just link it right back up. So that'll be it for this video. This is the easiest modification I have done to my light show, which would be probably the only modification I'll do to this light show. So I thank you for watching. Please subscribe, comment, and like this video and have a great day.